in Virginia Beach, a memorial now sits at the intersection of First Colonial Road and South Hall Drive. At that spot one week ago tonight, someone hit and killed a two year old child then drove away. Police later located 77 year old Raul Santiago. He is now charged with felony hit and run. Tonight, 10 on your side's Michelle Wolf found witnesses to this tragedy. She joins us tonight with their versions of events. Michelle? Tom, we're continuing to learn more about the events leading up to the death of a two year old who was crossing the street. I spoke to a man who witnessed the moment a truck fatally hit a child in a stroller and immediately called for help. It was horrible. I have never seen such disregard for life. Kyle Ashley was leaving his neighborhood and waiting to turn left onto First Colonial Road from South All Drive last Friday. As he waited for the light to change, he watched a man with two young children, one in a stroller, cross First Colonial Road, heading toward Aldi. Ashley says the family of three was halfway into the crosswalk when a man driving a white truck coming from Aldi turned right at the red light onto First Colonial and struck the two-year-old child in the stroller. Ashley says the man didn't stop and kept driving. Immediately called 911. Um, got pretty emotional, not going to lie. Ashley returned to the scene one week later where a memorial of flowers, stuffed animals, and toys has formed. Ashley had no idea the child died and asked him on your side for an update. It'll be a night I don't, never forget, unfortunately. Ashley feels for the child's family and asks all drivers in Hampton Roads to pay attention. Please, please just... Ex, you know, take pedestrians seriously. If you see someone crossing the street in downtown Norfolk, you know, here in Virginia Beach, just please take pedestrians seriously. Another witness that night, Megan Taylor, who was cleaning a building across the street. She was leaving for the night when she saw flashing lights taking over the road. It seemed like just about the entire Virginia Beach Police Department was there. It's so tragic. I can't imagine. I feel so terrible for the family. Taylor has a young child herself. Well, I have a four year old, so that really hits home and I just can't imagine something like that happening to me or anybody that I know. There was no way he didn't know that he hit a child in a stroller and took off like that. We tried reaching Santiago for comment. We were unsuccessful. Michelle Wolf, 10 on your side.